Middle child, two brothers. We're actually very close, but they live in different states. Only child. Childhood obsessions. Christmas, magic. I want you to hold me. My name is Michael. You're a great dancer. You're a terrible liar. And that's Kit. I've always imagined that my life was like a typical romantic comedy. You were so confident. I mean, you just swept off your clothes like you're a stripper at a bachelorette party. And I basically shower with clothes on. <laughs> I'll just shut up now. Shall we go to your place tonight? Here's my door. Before we go in, just open the door. Okay. What is this, Michael? Oh, you don't want to... Oh my God, they're in here too. Oh, Papa. You turn my sixes to nine. I think you're very cool, and I'm worried that you're going to break my heart. No, I'm bad. This is my friend, Mike. A friend? Yes, Mom. Just a friend. What is going on here? Who is this guy? He's my boyfriend. Your boyfriend? I think it's a great kid. We may not look like it, but we are actually kind of hip. Oh, my God. We were going to go to Woodstock, you know. Slam. I am. Let's just take a moment to appreciate this beauty. Kit, what is going on? Are you all right? Calm down off the ledge, Mike. I'm seeing a doctor tomorrow. I'm afraid the news isn't good. I was always afraid Kit would break my heart, and eventually he did. He broke it open. I've only got to run the race in front of you because that's all there is. Looking back, this is less of a rom-com and more of a love story. He can't sit for four hours. We promised a bed. All the beds are occupied. Get my husband a bed! Well, that was Oscar worthy. Work for Shirley MacLaine. I'm sorry I never told you how good your ass looks in your khaki pants. <laughs> I was afraid if you understood how beautiful you are that you'd leave me. Thank you for inviting us. It was Kit's idea. I was vehemently opposed to it. Like all love stories, it never actually ends.